What's up, guys? Welcome to JMAC Sports Cards. My name is Jason. CSG has announced updates, and they have announced the new price increase, which some were speculating on how much it was going to be because, um, you know, news was trickling out that they that they were going to be doing this. They were going to be raising prices and that um, making a few, a few different changes. Well, uh, I was uh, checking my email and I saw that this, e this email came through and it, it has the, it has the details, not in the email, but this kind of just describes it. It says, uh, submissions to CSG have grown quickly since the company launched in mid-February. In recent weeks, the new dy dynamics, PSA closing its doors, and, and SGC raising prices, that's what new dynamics means. And BGS being backed up in the market have caused CSG submission volumes to grow even more rapidly. I would say... We've all been knowing that's going to be happening, especially with the 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 prices that they had had almost exponentially in a matter of days. CSG is excited to meet this incredible demand and provide its service to collectors and dealers seeking another option for sports cards. So they did say they've they've taken a couple of steps here. They've taken a number of steps to increase output and capacity. These steps include hiring more than 70 new employees in the last three months, purchasing an additional 21,000 square feet of space and implementing comprehensive training programs bringing in efficiency consultants and working thousands of hours of overtime i bet you have been csg has increased incentives to motivate and re uh, and reward employees to attract new talent um and here it is here's the info here's the deadlines to support these and other efforts as well as to better reflect the current state of the market csg is updating its Services and fees effective April 28, 2021. The new fees apply to all CSG online submission forms completed as at that date. Submission forms completed before April 28 must be delivered to CSG's facility. Must be delivered by May 28 to qualify for the old pricing. What did I do today? <laughs> Load it up, boy. Load it up, boy. Uh, got a bulk order here. Of uh, a hundred and fifty two card bulk order, so I'm getting I'm getting the big order in, and I even got and then the, the, I give away a little, a little tip someone told me: include one card uh, express, then you write ex around the whole box. And they'll check it in first, so you that way your cards won't be sitting. It may not get processed. The express one will get processed quicker. Uh oh, stuff's falling. Um, the, you know, the other cards will still, the other bulk cards will still get processed. I guess on a bulk timeline, but even someone who did this said that that expedited the bulk order. So uh, we'll go find out. Um, but. It's really not that bad of an increase in, in prices, but we knew it was coming. Uh, well, it's kind of it's kind of bad because um, their higher tiers are, are much higher. Let's look at it and let's see exactly what the price increases are going to be now. So the link in the email takes you here to their site, which is a blog post that they put up or an announcement page or something. The, you know, it goes in a little bit more detail here. And if you're basically saying the same thing, this is where the email stopped and it continues here. We know that many collectors and dealers have speculated that CSG would raise fees. <laughs> I see what I'm saying. There was videos coming out or even limit submissions. CSG has no plans to limit submissions, but we have determined that a reasonable increase to our fees is appropriate and necessary. Even with this price increase, CSG still offers the most advantageous fees in the sports card certification industry. We are honored that so many collectors and dealers are trusting their sports cars to CSG, and we look forward to continue to provide best in class, blah, 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 blah. And then it says, if you or anyone is interested uh, in coming and grading some cards, go check it out. Could be a new career uh, career role here um, with the PSA, <laughs> uh, moving to AI, but they're still going to keep people, and they've hired, they're have hired. they hiring and hiring and hiring, and, you know, HGA keeps bumping up their card submission amount, and CSG's growing. 
I mean, this is a whole new career field that's, that's, that's uh, coming uh, online for a lot of people. So um, here we go, though. Here's the unveiling of the new prices. Here's the updated CSG fee, uh, services and fees effective April 28th. So I got my order uh, up. I mean, and this kind of clears out a backlog that I've had of cards I want to get graded. I'm keeping some high end. I probably got a stack of about... 20 i don't know 15 or 20 cards that are i would say are probably all you know maybe 250 to a thousand dollar or more uh cards a couple of them 1500 or so that i'm keeping out to submit whenever psa opens back up but here's their new pricing so bulk goes from eight dollars to twelve dollars so that is a I said it wasn't bad, but when we think about it on a percentage basis, it's an actually a, actually a 50% in price increase. The this one goes from 15 to 20, so you're looking at a 33% increase. This one, what was standard? This one was 15. Was that 25 or? I can't remember what that one was. I know Express because I just did Express. Express was. 40 now 60 again that's a 50 percent increase and i think walkthrough was 100 so that's a 25 percent might be wrong on that nonetheless uh yeah so you're looking at a, a, a 25 to 50 percent increase on every level there submission forms completed before f28 must be delivered again they're just reiterating the fact that you need to get them in uh, in their hands or at least have it say delivered um, whatever, if you're using, uh, you know, UPS or FedEx or USPS, if the tracking on it shows it got there and was delivered before May 28th, you'll be good. So I expect them to get a crap ton of cards shipped starting today, tomorrow, and just like PSA. Um, so now this is going to be, I got 150 here. Now, I'm, and I sent 250 bulk orders already, so I got, I'm going to wind up having 250 CSG cards graded uh, whenever I get them all back. Um, so, I think I'm just, I'm not the only one here. So, um, and, I, and I'm probably, I'm a very small drop in a bucket com in comparison to the bulk submitters and all those, all the other players. And I personally have done all, all of my submissions individually. It just was, it was just easier. Just, I just feel like if I, if I got to send it to a group, I know... In some cases, it makes sense because, you know, what. but the thing is, to use a group submitter, you got to send it one time to the group submitter, and the group submitter sends it to the, it's just another layer. So, uh, and if it's financially feasible, I can definitely see in some cases where, you know, it makes sense to send, if, if you get a, a good enough discount through the group submitter, it makes sense, but... This is this was bound to happen. The industry is exploding and, and continuing to. People are hungry and hungry to, um, you know, You know, this just keeps expanding. The the sports car market and industry now is is growing and growing and growing. People thought it was going to be slowing down, um, but you know, the, the thing with the way investing works is investing just in general. If you're unaware, I, I do have a uh, a much bigger uh, a stock market investing YouTube channel, JMAC Investing. So, uh, links in the video description below if you want to check that out. So, I, under I understand I investing, and I mean, the way it works is you know, as you invest, there's a snowballing effect and there's a compounding effect that, that occurs here. And I think that's what, hap what has happened here in the sports, mar sports card market, where you know, before it was really just a hobby. Now, for many people, it is a, um, you know, it has become really a, a very decent income stream and, you know, car flipping is now on the rise. So you got inventory that's, that's moved, that's being moved much more than in previous. And the, the, the card companies are putting out much better quality products than they ever have in the past, in my humble opinion. Um, yeah, of course, I, I do think that at some point, uh, we, you, you're going to see that uh, when, all, when all of the services come back online, all of the grading services, I think you're going to see that there are actually going to be a lot of cards 
uh, could be comparative to the junk wax era where people think they got, you know, uh, something real, um, especially like the prism stuff, you know, I think they're, they're, I think they're pumping out a whole lot of that product. So I don't think it's as rare or as valuable as, uh, the prices people pay for it. So <laughs> that's just my opinion. So continuing to invest into the goats and to, uh, you know, middle career players is a good strategy. Um, and so this whole box, a lot of this box is some older Hall of Fame players, Jordans, uh, Larry Bird, Scottie Pippen, um, you know, some, some older football players, stuff like that. So, you know, this, this is coming, but I'm excited. I mean, this is, this is going to be, this is going to be quite a uh, submission here. And so what I did was actually, because I had talked about it in a previous video, what I did was I just picked quick submit. So it added two dollars, but I got them for ten, and I didn't have to enter anything. So I, you know, so I said, one hundred and fifty cards, quick submit, and none of them are autographed, so they're all ten dollars. So one hundred and fifty cards is fifteen hundred dollars, straight up. Add uh, some taxes or fees and. Uh, shipping and you know it wasn't much, it wasn't much over fifteen hundred, sixteen hundred dollars or something like that for a hundred and fifty cards, and so to me that was uh, I wanted to get that done, and then it'll be the fives and tens I'll be sending out in future dates to whoever, SGC, PSA when it comes back online, um, and still this is this still twelve dollar fifty card bulk submission with CSG, it will still be a viable option for me for some of the cheaper stuff, you know? So, you know, really still gonna be a player, no doubt about it, And uh, but as, as stated, some of this is 50 plus percent increase in pricing. One more thing I wanna show you, Luka Doncic struck a deal with uh, Panini. So I thought this was pretty cool. Luka Doncic, Panini signed exclusive autograph memorabilia deal. If you're looking for Luka Doncic, Autograph going forward. All roads lead through Panini America. The Dallas Mavs superstar and car maker announced an exclusive deal today. And the agreement, which covers multiple years, covers both trading cards and memorabilia. So that means, you know, there'll probably be a lot more Luca uh, autos in in the in Panini's products. So that's pretty cool. Maybe maybe some you know exclusive stuff for uh, Luca, which will be really awesome. Memorabilia signed by the 22-year-old, including uh, photos, jerseys, and basketball will be available through the Panini authentic arm of the company. Other Panini exclusive athletes include, so Panini has exclusive rights also to Kevin Durant, Charles Barkley, John ja Morant, and Anthony Edwards. So look for all these players to probably have some exclusive stuff and probably have lots of uh, auto patches, jersey patches, and all this kind of stuff. So... Um, you know, I just wanted to share that real quick in and off here. Hope you guys have a great uh, investing journey. I appreciate those that uh, those of you that are finding me, checking me out. Uh, do me a favor, hit that like button. It helps the video get noticed. Subscribe if you haven't already. Need to get the subscriber count up because a lot of people are viewing uh, my videos and not subscribing. So do that. Subscribe. Turn on the notification bell. That'll get you notified when new videos come out. That's all I got. Till next time, guys. Hope you guys have a great one. Doses.